Hello everyone and welcome to another game against Sabine Cardinals and the Gladewater Bears. This is our second matchup. Um, sorry, this is the second time we've faced the Gladewater Bears and we're already off and running. We started the game a little early today so um, that's why we're live at 4.30 instead of 5 o'clock. So, um, just got the game going. The colors kind of go along with our school. So Sabine's the blue team and the Bears are the orange team. Also their colors. And we just had a score from Francisco Perez. So a little more than 30 seconds into the game. Sabine is leading uh, one to zero. We're at the kickoff, and four of the teams or four of the players reach the ball at the same time. <clears throat> Gladewater punts it across the field, going towards the Sabine side. <clears throat> Tex hits the ball towards their goal, comes back in for a follow up shot, and makes a score. If you haven't seen our streams before or even the Rocket League game, um, it's basically soccer with cars. So we've got a three versus three here. Um, and our players are uh, Fusion is um, Jonathan Ferguson, Mean Daddy is Tex Francisco, and Code Swifts is Francisco Perez. Gladewater gets control of the ball, pushes it towards Sabine's side. Francisco gets control of it after him. Gladewater's in the goal, ready for someone to make a shot. Gets bumped by Francisco. <laughs> shot on Sabine's goal by Gladewater. Hits the top bar. Bounces towards the middle of the goal. Gladewater takes it away from Francisco. Tex gets control of it. Trying to turn it around. Jonathan has an open goal almost, and there it goes into the goal for three to zero win, uh, lead right now. Oh, I swear, Braden, that's not fair. Jonathan gets control of the ball, pushes it towards the middle, takes a little bit of a shot on it, it's a little left of the goal. Clydewater takes it away, has an open goal, hits the right side of the goal. Tex pushes it out towards the middle. Gladewater has a save there. Nike with the Gladewater side gets control of the ball, pushing it towards Sabine's side. Tex bumps it, it almost goes into the Sabine goal. Have a shot on Gladewater and Tex Francisco gets, this, gets the goal there. They head towards the middle, pops up in the air towards the Sabine side. I'm sorry, the Gladewater side. Hits above the goal.
David Veit gets control of it, pushes it towards the middle. Nike gets control. This has an open goal on Sabine, and he scores, bringing our score four to one. We've got a minute and 34 seconds left in the game. Still plenty of time. Two teams square off. Francisco tries to maintain control of it. Can't get it in Gladewater's goal. The Bears now have control with Nike having the ball. Pops it up. He's trying to push it towards the middle. Sabine's trying to take it back from them. Gladewater rushes in and misses the ball. Trying to push it more towards Sabine. Got an open goal. Oh, and then Tex Francisco makes a save. <laughs> Tex, Tex and Francisco both fighting over control of the ball. Gladewater comes in behind them and, and kicks it out of the uh, goal area. Jonathan stays back, punts it towards the Gladewater side. Oh, and Sabine scores. The two Gladewater players right there trying to trying to get it out as best they could, doing some flips and trying to push it out, but it ends up rolling in. Twenty eight seconds left, the two teams face off. I don't care about points. Heads more towards the Gladewater side now. Jonathan Ferguson misses the ball. Francisco comes back in and hits it. Pushing it towards Gladewater's goal. It's wide left. Gladewater maintains control now. But Francisco tries to take it back from open goal with Gladewater, and it's slightly left. Can't come in with the follow up shot. And our time is up, and Sabine wins the first game. One. No. Uh, I don't think I will. Best, we're doing best uh, three out of five. So that's one game down. And Sabine needs to win two more to win the whole series. Francisco had two goals on that. Tex has two goals. And Jonathan had one. And on the Bears side, Nike had one goal with the Gladewater Bears. Both teams <clears throat> pick their sides, and we're about to start off on our second game. Sabine hits it harder and gets it towards the Gladewater side. Trying to come back in with a follow-up shot. Gladewater was in the goal trying to save it, but couldn't get up in the air to push it out, so Sabine scores. It's a nice aerial shot by Francisco. A little backflip there and there. Both teams get there about the same time. Francisco's there trying to do an arrow shot and Jonathan comes right beside him and pushes it, pushes it in. What you're going to see on these games is, is the teams are trying to get it more towards the middle as they can and then hoping their team their teammate comes in and pushes it all the way in. So you'll see our, our players a lot of times on the sides of the goals trying to get it towards the middle as the best they can. Where's he at? Claydewater pushes it out for a good save there. Nike and David Veit fight over control of it. Francisco and Tex both come in trying to take it back. Jonathan comes back in with a pushing it towards Gladewater's side. David Veit cut, tries to come in with a quick save there, but uh, Francisco was able to get it in the goal before he could make it. Good save there by Gladewater. 
hit up high towards the middle. Gladewater needs to push it out before Sabine comes in and gets it in their goal. Nike pushing it forward, boots it over to Sabine's side. Trying to get control of it. We have two Sabine players there in, the, in their goal ready for it. Francisco does an aerial shot to try to push it out and was successful. Jonathan pushing it more towards Gladewater. Tex comes in behind him. Hits it up high. Trying to push it more towards the middle for his teammate, but was unable to get control of it. Gladewater shoots it on Sabine's goal. Hits the top bar. David Veit is uh, coming back to try to get it away from their goal. And was successful. Jonathan fights for control of it, pushes it towards the middle. But Nike comes in and pushes it out. It was a good save. Now it's on Sabine's side. David Veit comes in, trying to push it towards the middle for one of his teammates. But Sabine comes in and punts it downfield. Francisco takes, takes a shot on the goal. Sabine punts it towards the middle. Glade Art is there, ready for him. <clears throat> Fusion comes in trying to push it into the goal as best he can. There were several players there. One player got demoed. Francisco pushes it uh, to the other side. I'm sorry, Gladewater pushes it towards Sabine's side. Let's look at that again. David Veit had a pretty good shot there. We had two Sabine players there, but they were just unsuccessful in getting out of out of our goal. So now that brings our score score three to one in favor of Sabine with two minutes and nine seconds left. Shot on Gladewater's goal, but way too high. Francisco Perez comes back in with another shot, but it's a little bit right. <clears throat> Francisco trying to push it towards the middle for his teammate, but Gladewater was there to push it further out. Jonathan Ferguson trying to get a shot in there. Francisco comes above him and pushes it into Gladewater's goal, giving us Sabine another score, bringing us to four to one. A minute 44 seconds left. Two teams face off. Gladewater gets to the ball first, but Tex is there to quickly push it back. David Veit pushes it towards Sabine's side. Francisco backs up and hits it more towards Gladewater. OMG Pro uh, pushes it on Sabine's side. Met there by a couple of Sabine players. Gladewater on their goal, trying to push it out, and they were successful. Tex was not able to punch it in. Tex pushes it towards the middle. Francisco tries to do a spin aerial move and was close, but unable to get it in the goal. We've got one minute remaining. Gladewater is here for the shot. Sabine tries to take it away from him and push him out. I need some to turtle. You need to turtle. Yes, I do. I didn't score on the last one. Josh! Sabine trying to get it towards the middle. Play to water takes it away from him. Hits it hard towards Sabine's side. Jonathan there to the goal to push it out with a good save. 30 seconds left. Jonathan pushes it towards the middle. Francisco's coming in for the follow-up shot. No, I almost scored. But Francisco doesn't touch it, and... Uh, Jonathan gets the goal on that one. Bringing our score five to one with 21 seconds left. <clears throat> Two teams face off. Gladewater hits it hard towards Sabine's side. Francisco comes in with an aerial shot to take it away from David Veit. David comes back towards his side trying to punch it out. 
Keep it up, keep it up. Jonathan in the air, trying to get control of it. And Sabine wins the second game, bringing our series uh, two to zero. Francisco had three goals on that one, and Jonathan had two. And uh, David Veit for the Gladewater side had one goal. So if Sabine wins this game, the series will be over because it is best three out of five. Teams face off. Gladewater, I'm not sure if they weren't ready or not, but Sabine gets to it first and tries to get control of it, but now Gladewater is ready and they're getting it away from their goal. Jonathan comes in with a spin move. Francisco's trying to put it in the goal, but Gladewater is there to push it out. Francisco putting it in the middle for his teammates, but David Byte is there to take it away from him. Tex takes a shot on Gladewater's goal, but it was a little bit left, hit the poles. And now Nike has an open goal on Sabine and is able to score, bringing the score one to zero in favor of Gladewater right now. Four minutes and 24 seconds. Both teams face off. Gladewater hits it harder, goes towards Sabine's side. <clears throat> Jonathan tries to get control of it in the air, but he missed the ball. Tex had an open goal and was able to push it in. Now bringing our score one to one. OMG was in the goal, ready for him, but he pushed it far left to where uh, OMG couldn't get to it. Francisco tries to take control of it. Gladewater takes it away from him. David Veit's trying to push it out. Sabine comes in with a shot, but unable to get it in. <clears throat> David Veit keeps pushing it towards Sabine's side. Nike now gets control of it. But Tex takes it away. He's in the middle. Francisco is able to push it in. Bringing our score two to one. Three minutes and 36 seconds left in the game. I'm trying. Jonathan took control of the ball. We had no other players trying to go for the ball at the same time, so I'm not sure what was going on. Francisco hits it in the air. Two Gladewater <laughs> players are there, ready. Both teams fighting over control of the ball. Nike comes in, but uh, wanted to get boost instead of getting the ball. Now he's ready to go back towards it. <clears throat> Jonathan and two other Gladewater players fighting over control of it. Francisco now has control, but Nike's coming in to try to take it away from him. He's successful. No. David Veit with a good aerial shot there. He's able to hit it, going towards Sabine's side. <clears throat> Francisco getting control of it, but Nike's able to take it away from him. Uh, I really don't feel like talking. What? Jonathan there for a good save on Sabine's goal. Francisco Perez now in control of it. Was hit by another car, but was able to maintain control. Ooh, shoots on their goal, but Gladewater is there to kick it out. I get a free kill off that. Jonathan shoots on an open goal and is able to score. <laughs> Bringing our score three to one in favor of Sabine.
You can do a roll so fast. Quit running. I just drove up to her. Both teams face off. Glade Water hits it harder and goes towards the bean side. Jonathan Ferguson trying to get control of it. Two Glade Water players are there to take it from him. Oh, he's upfield. But Tex and Francisco both come in, get control oh, of it, push it towards the middle. I think they bounced off of each other, so they were unable to push it in. <clears throat> Francisco putting it towards the middle, hoping one of his teammates is there. But Gladewater comes in and hits it hard towards the bean side. <laughs> Nike's there for an open goal. David Veit is there in front of him and is able to score. I'm there for this. Bringing our score three to two now in favor of Sabine. <clears throat> Both teams face off. OMG and Nike both try to get control of it. OMG pushes it towards middle for David Vite. David Vite pushes it in there towards Sabine's side. All three Sabine players are there trying to get control of it. Jonathan hits it towards the middle. Tex gets control of it and pushing it more towards Gladewater's side. Hits above the goal on that one. Tex takes another shot, but it's slightly left. Nike's there to, to push the ball out. Francisco pushing it towards the middle, trying to do some aerial shots to get it in. Slightly above, but Tex is there to punch it back in there. See, our team, uh, Sabine team is really uh, working pretty well today um, as a team, calling the shots, working together, telling them each other when they're going to have the ball ready for the other players and in the middle. And um, So it's working, working pretty well. Got 30 seconds left. OMG had a good save there. David kicks it to the side, tries to come back in with a follow-up shot. Jonathan's there to get it away from their goal. It goes towards the middle now, but Gladewater's there to take a shot. But it's too high. Tex does a flip move and hits it more towards Gladewater's side, and time expires. Um, and now Sabine has won the third match, which gives them the win for the whole series. So we have uh, Tex with two goals on that one, Francisco with one, and Jonathan with one, uh, David Veit with one goal, and Nike with one goal for the Gladewater side. So we, we always enjoy playing someone that's um, close to our location. We're very familiar with Gladewater. We play them in, in all of our other sports. So it's, uh, it's nice to play someone who we know. Um, we're familiar with their school. So... Um, we're glad everybody could join us, whether you're joining us on the live stream or on the YouTube video. So uh, we hope you enjoyed it, and we will catch you next time. They did better this time.